I've recorded this about 10 times. It's this week's recommended Blender download. <laughs> Let's go. Alright guys, how's it going? It's came to that time of the week again where I scour the internet looking for the best downloads for your downloading pleasure. As always, please support third party developers and artists. Now I generally do not start with a commercial add-on but this is too good of a deal to pass up. Essentially AFX has put all of these add-ons down to $5. Now I'm not making any money off this, there's no affiliation link, I just think it's a great deal. So if you've got a little bit of spare cash, it's definitely worth picking up stuff like cloth effects for 5 bucks. Usually retails around 25, so you're making a good saving here. Same with things like Gribble FX. Let's move this over to the Render Layer Manager. It's a free Blender add-on that provides an easy and fast setup of the Render Layer and File Output nodes. Now personally, I've not used this. I've spoken to a few users who have, and he says it's pretty damn good, so it might be worth checking that out as well. And it is available for free. I'll put all the links in the description down below. So let's move this over to Blender Artist. I made a real-time render add-on. I post it here so you can use it. This add-on estimates the total render time of the whole animation. It also plays a sound when the frame or the render is done. Kind of reminds me of Lightwave a little bit. Now, I'm not entirely sure how good this add-on is because obviously things play a factor when it comes to render time. So, for example, if the camera gets closer to geometry, who knows, but it might be worth checking it out over the week and giving it a quick review. Moving over to the light sheet caustics for Cycles and Eve. Now this is great for doing things underwater or maybe glass for example. Light sheet is a blender add-on for creating fake caustics that can be rendered with Cycles and Eve. Hmm, nice one, cheers much. Now let's move this over to Gumroad. I thought this deserved an honourable mention. And it's the Rocket Girl for Blender 2.9. Now the developer or the artist behind it has been doing a lot of work regarding the facial rig and it's available for free, and it's also a good resource, so check this one out as well. Now, there's a good chance you've seen this on Twitter, and it's a Lightning Boy Studio. Lightning Boy Studio Toon Facial Rig Blender Eve. Check out this bad boy. I cannot believe this is for free. Definitely quickly grabbing this file. And this is from Skyseek, Automatic and Infinitive Loop Custom Blender Node. They also have a stylized wood, which is available for free as well. Moving over to David, and it's the Modern Street Objects free sample, so you're getting a couple of nice models. But I thought, this is one of these pages you should probably bookmark. You have the Sci-Fi console, which is available for free as well, and there's also some very nice assets here. Let's move this over to Polygon Runaway. Absolute great resource, but this is an abstract animation blender scene. Might be worth checking out if you want to learn how to do a little bit of abstract stuff. Let's move this over to Eris, and it's the Simple Geometry Node Scatter version 001 Blender 2.92, and it's available for free, so if you want to learn how to do geometry nodes with the Scatter node, it might be worth it. And talking about nodes, the king of nodes, hallelujah, hallelujah, it's Erendale. Untiling node for Blender 2.82, now this is quite old to be honest, no more texture tiling artifacts, nice, thanks Ern. Let's move this over to the next artist, and it's the free Blender 2.8 height blend version 1, and there also is a Blender 2.8 procedural dust shader, and these are all free as well, cracking deal. Now this is my commercial add-on of the week, I actually reviewed this months and months back, you could have grabbed it for free, if you'd done that, you would have got it for free at the moment, but it's 17 bucks, and it's the Step Importer. Now the reason I've made this my commercial add-on, I've been importing a lot of STP files lately into Blender for product rendering, and it's been an absolute lifesaver, so check that one out if you're into your CAD stuff. And moving over to Sketchfab Download of the Week, this is an absolute cracking model, check this bad boy out, it's even animated, and then it's a stylized World War 1 plane, check it out, that is gorgeous. And just quickly wrapping up, it's the PBR Material of the Week, and it's the Brickwall 001 from Texture Haven, and finishing it up with HDRI Haven, it's the Christmas Photo Studio 01. Thanks for watching, it's been this week's recommended Blender downloads, do me a favour guys, give the video a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, follow me on Twitter and support me on all the social media links. If you want to get in contact and you want something mentioned, just drop me a DM, you know what to do, take care.